It is good to see you again. When I surrendered to Lord Nasher, I was certain my execution would be swift. But it seems Lord Nasher has chosen to let me live, for now at least. I am glad, if for no other reason than it gives me a chance to see you again. I am at peace for the first time since Fenthic's death, and I have you to thank. You saved me. I no longer fear my fate. When Fenthic... When Fenthic was executed, I thought I had lost everything. But now I see this is not true. I have you. You were there when I was in my darkest hour. You were there when I needed you. But I was too blind to see. But you never gave up on me. I have found myself again. And I finally see how... how special you are to me. They say it is better to have loved and lost than not to have loved at all. I never used to believe that, until now. I loved Fenthic with all my heart, and his memory will always be dear to me. But that does not mean I can never love another. Perhaps in time we might, if things had been different. Lord Nasher has not passed judgment on me yet. I am content with whatever fate awaits, but in his eyes, I see hope that I might live. Should Neverwinter survive, he may choose another sentence for me. I may yet be given a chance to make some small amends for what I have done. There is yet hope for me, and for us. Forgive me for speaking so frankly about this. My heart could not stay silent, but I should not have burdened you with this. Not while you still must face Morag. If fate is kind, perhaps we will be able to continue this once Morag is slain. But while she lives, we must set our own feelings aside for the greater good. Perhaps if I had learned this lesson long ago, tragedy could have been averted. Forgive me, but I will speak of my feelings for you no more. You must concentrate on the task at hand. <laughs>